All right, welcome back to the night shift, ladies and gentlemen. You're working late, and so are we. It's time to clock in. We're out here on the mean fucking streets of Cleveland right now, yo. I got really upset. Did you just fucking smash it? Yeah. Anyways, all right, listen, we're out here for the Jake Paul fight. By the time you guys watch this video, that fight already will have been decided. There will be a victor. It's definitely going to be Jake Paul, but I just mean, like, it's not, the fight hasn't happened yet. So last night we went to, uh, what's it called, Barley House? Yep. This girl came back, and David said he saw her change her boyfriend's name in her phone from Zach with mad hearts to Zach. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Poor Zach. Ooh. Logan bought a Mooncat NFT and KSI retweeted it. Him oh. and KSI are like best friends now. Don't <laughs> God, how often are you guys talking hey, these days? Business. There's never a time I'm not talking to him. Just, it's just a constant flow of conversation. Constant back and forth. YouTube's not really your thing anymore, but you get an offer one day. Logan, we'd really like for you to join the side men. What's your answer? Absolutely. You're not that guy, pal. <laughs> Wait, what? I, mean, I don't think you use that right. You didn't, you didn't use that right at all. I was not expecting that reaction. It's not, the fuck? That, you mean Bazinga? Don't you fucking ever talk about eating like that. What That's my friend. Now, I didn't even get to see any of them because you took George instead, you fucking asshole. I fucking told you to be friends with those motherfuckers a year ago. I've been trying to fucking save that bridge from burning down. That is about to explode. And you went fishing with them without me. Jesus. Yeah, he really wanted that fishing trip, man. God damn. And now a word from our sponsors. You're probably asking yourself, Mike, how'd you get this close to the action? Well, today's video is sponsored by SeatGeek. That's right, live events are officially back, and that means you're getting $20 off tickets on SeatGeek when you use promo code MIKE. If you don't know what SeatGeek is, they're a ticketing app that makes buying tickets super simple. I've got the app on my phone, and it's far and away the easiest way to buy tickets online. Whether it's concerts, baseball, basketball, football festivals, or more, SeatGeek puts tickets from all over the web in one place to make buying simple. Plus, SeatGeek rates every ticket from zero to 10 to make sure you're getting a good deal. Green means good, red means bad. So like I said, I got the hookup for you guys today. Just click the link in the description below to download the SeatGeek app and use promo code Mike to get $20 off your first order of tickets at SeatGeek. Damn, a little bit too close to the action. Let's get back to the night shit, baby. Wait, that a bike what, a what the actual fuck is going, why is there a bike inside of a fucking tree, I Logan? You that you were at Greg Paul's house. <laughs> Look, read that sign. No vehicles beyond this point. No in GP, you're, she's just driving <laughs> fucking C4 in the middle of the fucking road. <laughs> On your turf. Well, it's right On your turf. Hey, somebody oh, drove their uh, bike through a tree out there. I know, it's the craziest thing. He was 12 feet long, weighed 80 pounds, and he died of pneumonia, so I got him skinned. Look at how long it is, though. That's so that we, was a yeah, yeah, we used to let it run around the house. Right. Yeah, it would run. Vic, you're telling me this rug <laughs> at one point moved efficiently. <laughs> oh my god, it's a taxidermy dog. I was like very he's, young he's when that dog was alive. His name was Yogi. He's a he's chow. Good. But he's not alive now, he even though it looks like opposite of that. So, yes, as I said, that dog is, is dead and it's been stuffed and Logan's live dog sniffing the dead stuffed dog is exactly what I expect to find here in Ohio. Whoa, whoa, boy! Fuck, he, tried to, he tried to nip me, dude. I swear he tried to fucking nip me. That's fucking weird, David. I don't know what they do in Germany. I'm telling you, in Connecticut, I've never seen the dead dog slain on the floor. Look, look. Quinn's trying to play with him. Come on. No, no. Daddy. Daddy. No. Daddy. no. Play. Hey, Quinn, bad news. He's fucking dead. Dude. What the fuck is going on? So, I don't fucking know. That's Greg Paul. The city boys can't handle this shit. Yeah, let me tell you something, man. Nobody can handle this fucking shit. I don't care if you're from the city or the fucking country. All right? Go get it. We're currently at the Jake Paul press conference, uh, the weigh-in the day before the fight. There's never a bad time for chicken tenders. We got a couple different flavors here. We got hot. We this got so barbecue. Why'd you touch me and say hot? I don't eat. I don't eat this. I don't eat anything that my hands get messy and I, I get weird. I yeah. will place this fucking chicken tender so far down your throat right now. You won't even have to touch it. What's the worst? So here's the cute part about you being a brand new citizen to the beard land. I eat that. It stays with me for the rest of the day. Chicken tenders are one of the most versatile foods on the planet. <laughs> See how easy that was? You stick a chicken tender in any normal American's face, they're gonna eat that chicken tender. Here, George. No. Oh. Like, what the fuck is that, dude? I can just, like, go. You could do that. <laughs> Logan's getting in a fight. Come on! Come on! You fucking meatball! <laughs> Come on. 
<laughs> what the fuck? Oh, you got you got LCD screens in you now? <laughs> it's a highlight reel of Woodley getting knocked out. Woodley's gonna be cursed on the floor tomorrow. Here with Sugar. We just did the Impulsive podcast. How did you feel about it? Was Dude, that honestly, it was probably on top one. That's probably number one. <laughs> we just had two very interesting girls that we were talking to. We it's, thought they were hookers, but apparently they no, didn't. No, 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 they were. They didn't. I don't know. No, nah, they said they wanted to go eat. That means they're hookers. I thought they were just two very normal girls with giant, giant fake titties, giant maybe a fake right. ass. We gotta go. Let's go. Why don't you? Why don't you shove this light in the cop's face, Mike? Do you want to know what I've been looking for? A videographer that has no mouth. Do you know how you find one? Oh, they, Craigslist. Reed, I've never, Craigslist. I've never, I've never heard Reed say anything. And he just shoots. David's always, Mike, you shouldn't shoot right now. The cops. Get the fucking beast. Say something inspirational. If you want to be real chat, don't party. <laughs> You want some fries, champ? You want some fries? See, that's how you start off a good episode of a Night Shift Burger review. Giving out a little a little food to somebody that's hungry. Enjoy those, brother. You don't fucking give them a- Yo, you want a burger? You want a burger? Oh, wow. So, we don't usually review chairs on this channel, but yeah, fuck it. I'll, for you, Sugar, let's do a chair review. Yeah, what this is chair looks, it, it looks like it's a heavier metal, but I think it's a shit plastic. <laughs> Yeah. Sorry, but I mean, it really, you could just fucking launch it if you didn't want to actually not launch it. So, <laughs> seven. Oh my this may be one of the more spontaneous uh, uh, burger reviews of all time. We got homeless people, we got fucking garbage changes, gunshots, chair, chair reviews. Getting a lot of requests for this place, Wahlburgers, supposedly owned by Mark Wahlberg, aka Marky Mark, aka the Hanes shit with the abs and all that shit. You got abs? <laughs> Not really. We grabbed like pretty much the classic burger. This is it here. American cheese. It's got the shredded lettuce, one little pickle and some tomato. I just hate to say this straight off the bat, dude. This, I, I, it doesn't look real fucking promising. You squeeze bro. it. Yeah, what do you look for when you squeeze? Juices. So go ahead. No, get it. Let David get in there. Yeah, no, nothing, not, not nothing much, juicy. Not, let's, let's give it a shot, boys. Here we go. Shot, boys. Cheers to the, cheers to the, yeah. yeah. Just the burger burger. It's fire. <laughs> it's kind of dry. To be honest, I need ranch. The more of these burgers I do, the more spoiled I get. The yeah. last one of these that I rated was I Australian Wagyu. Bro, high-end beef. This is local cow. This is this is Cleveland cow. If I see those people I see you, they would not believe me. So, can I have your autograph? Is everybody in here talking about Sugar Shane? Sugar Shane is in there? Yes, yes. Yeah, so I see y'all dipped out. Sugar Shane. Sugar Shane. It's, it, the pen's not the best pen ever. Sugar Shane, baby. Hey, I'm gonna take that. The bun's nothing great. The lettuce is not even that green. I'm not here to, here, here's what I'll say. I'm not here to shit on it. It's not Carl's Jr. bad, yeah. but it's mid. I mean, heavily, heavily mid, and I love Mark Wahlberg. I hate to fucking say that, but I gotta give this thing a 6.2, bro. This is 6.2. Dude, I'm, yeah, I'm not, I've never reviewed burgers too much, and uh, I would say 6.2 sounds about right. I'm gonna go 7.5. I'm thankful really? for it. I'm you thankful really? for it. You know, it doesn't matter if you're thankful for it. No, I'm thankful That's for not it. the end of the ratings. You can't be thankful. The ratings doesn't matter about being thankful. Like, what do you mean I'm thankful for it? I'm gonna say 6.5. <laughs> what do you fucking mean? 6.1, bitch. <laughs> and the food out to the homeless. Oh my god. Oh, we're trying. Oh, we're trying. What's up? Chili dog got the camera going. Yeah, I need a video, man. You need a video, man? Yeah. Music video or something? Yeah. Right up. Do video. I'm really excited, bro. And honestly, people keep asking me, what do you think is going to happen tonight? I get a little nervous every Ooh, time this happens. Do you ever get nervous, oh, nervous right before the shit? Not for my fight, but for Jake right now, I'm, 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 I'm the little, I have some nerves, champ. I mean, Woodley's a bat. He's, He's kind of good. A, He's good. But he keeps losing, though. Yeah, he does. Oh, what's up? Oh, you doing, man? I'm so sorry. What up? Sean, how you doing, buddy? Dude, when are you coming on our podcast, bro? Anytime, dude. Honestly, I'm on it right now. All right, welcome back to the Boston, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. The World Snow Podcast. No, okay, yeah, anytime, dude. I told Britt, we'll, we'll fly out. We'll have Islands, LA, whatever. Easily the most uh, requested episode ever. Oh, oh my God. God. Yeah, Can this I give you a hug? I, I am a huge fan of you. I watch all your guys' videos. Thank you. <laughs> Sugar! Fight! 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 Fight
Sweet 174 bought me a burger. Yes, sir. 2.4. And still a defeat. Listen, he's a, he's, he's a fucking maniac. He's the one, he's the fucking true. It's Jake fucking Paul, baby. So Jake Paul just won the fight in impressive fashion. I'm live right now with this Jake kid. Jake Paul got the dub. Jake he's, Paul got the dub. He's being forcibly ejected from the... A 40-year-old a 40 year old man hit me. I knocked out a 40-year-old man. Stop, everybody! Stop. 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 You, you, you got it, you got it, you got it. You got it. That's it, that's it. Tommy, 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 be careful. Do you want to keep Bruno? Do you want to keep him? Hey, 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 well, you can barely be my sparring partner for four Listen, rounds, bitch. Shut the fuck up. Who the fuck out of this? Who? 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 But I gotta tell you, every time I see you guys, I don't even know if you remember, you've been so incredibly kind. It means the world to me. And the fact that you're from. Rumble, young man. Rumble. <laughs> I love you too, man. We all stay safe, stay well. 100%. I would like free tickets to all of you. It is so exciting. It's the least we can do. And, 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 and that fight? I can see it again. I'm just throwing it out there. You all were cooking. Let's go again. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, man. This is where the greatest boxer on the planet was forged. Jake Paul worked out between these very walls. Let's go!